Hey y'all, welcome, welcome back to Interstage Window, my Saturday stream, which is a stream with my friends and I have here today with me, Kendra. Say hi, Kendra. Hi. Oh my gosh. Kendra is here today. Hello, Lunar. I see you got the first. Kendra already up to her nonsense with that Colonel Sanders gif. What the, what the heck? You just, everywhere right. you go, chaos. <laughs> <laughs> no one's surprised. <laughs> all right. If you guys would like to play Stardew with us today, here's the document that gives you all the instructions about the Stardew. Oh my gosh, it's Noms. Oh my God. Hello. <gasps> Noms. How are you doing today? Um, un uh, unbeknownst, unbeknownst to you, it is the same account. I didn't have to change anything. I do see you still have your mods. Today, <laughs> so we are good. Um, if you Noms. want to play with us, Basically, what the document tells you to do is you get into the Discord and you do all the things to verify yourself and then you want the farmer role and that will give you the link to the Zoom so that you can chat with us and I will also post the code for the actual Stardew game in there and we're playing on PC so that's if you want to join us you need the PC version of Stardew so that's how that's going to work. All right. Oh, shoot. There we go. Okay. I clicked on the wrong thing for a second. I clicked on the wrong thing. There we go. <laughs> Hang on, okay, I'm going to get it loaded. Let's show everybody the game. Here we go. So Kendra, how have you been since we last uh, since we last started? I've been good. Good. Been busy uh, working, cooking up, cooking up um, an RP with with our friends. Ooh, an mm. RP. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. An RP. I think it's funny that like two days before popped it in the tags you were like yeah i think i want to do this <laughs> um it was uh, so funny okay so there's the code i would just put it in the twitch chat and put it in the discord too that's perfect it was so funny like a couple of days um beforehand i was th i was just thinking like uh you know maybe like i want to do a, a role play again but like i don't really have time to run one but maybe i'll start like join to join one right I have no idea this whole fucking time. Kendra, Jane, and <laughs> Naomi are working on a Game of Thrones role play. What the heck and heck? Um, but they Embry. were. <laughs> oh, yeah, Embry, too. Um, but Embry. they were. But they were. We were. And then, and then um, I found out about it. And so then I was like, oh, well, this solves all my problems. I do not have to search anymore. <laughs> oh. No searching. That's right. It's like, oh. Kendra made this for me. This is um, my role play. Uh, that's yeah. what I said to myself. And then <laughs> I joined. <clears throat> so yeah, um, Lunar, Lunar says, tell us more. So tell them tell them about the role play, Kendra. Okay, so this role play, because I'm still on my Game of Thrones bullshit, uh, is set in, you know, Song of Ice and Fire world. But the first Blackfire Rebellion was successful. And the king is now Damon Blackfire. <gasps> Targaryens have been ousted. They are in Essos. No longer around. Bye bye. Wow. That's amazing. And everyone is just called to court, basically, to leave a hostage and bend the knee. Mm hmm. Super simple. Yep. So everybody go and hanging out in King's Landing. So in that way, it's kind of similar to what we did before with Summer Hall, but um, it's a little bit different also because Summer Hall, I don't know, I felt like Summer Hall was a little bit more complicated. This is a little bit simpler or it feels simpler for me to some reason, because basically all it is is the first Fl Blackfire Rebellion was successful, period. That's really it. Otherwise, it's basically <laughs> the same. Um, as the, as like canon, like all the history is, is the same. Um, Lunar, we have a player in there who has never read or watched Game of Thrones and they, they do just fine. Yeah. I mean, I really don't know anything about Game of Thrones. I mean, I watched the show, but I've never read the books. I was not super into the lore. So like, I'm always like kind of confused. I was confused in Summer Hall too. And I'm, don't don't worry, I'm confused in this as well. But it's a little bit less confusing than Summer <laughs> Hall. So literally, I walked in, I read everything, and I was like, oh, I don't really get it. Oh, guys, I don't really get it. And then I was like, but I want to play the, the magic girl. Like, I had a I had a magical Targaryen girl in Summer Hall. And I was like, I want to play a magical girl. And they were like, oh, you want to do this? And I said, okay. And that's it. That's all the thinking I've had to put in. I had to read her wiki page. It was very simple. 
<clears throat> and they that's, linked me the wiki it. page. So I didn't even have to go find it or, or make sure I was reading the right one. Yeah, we, we will take care of you. If you come in, it's basically all you need to know is it's medieval fantasy. Yeah. Ta-da! Yeah. Like, That's I it. think the things that, here's like the things that I've seen people get confused on is just like canon, magic is still rare. Um, so not everyone can have magical powers. And even if you have magical powers, like they're not going to work very often. So like, that's a thing. Um, we are pretty, um, uh, restrictive about that too. Yeah. And then like, the other thing I've seen people confused on is people are like, you know, I want to play a Targaryen. So they're going to come back from Essos. And it's like the, the RP just started. So you can't do that right now. So basically yeah. all the Targaryens got taken up really fast. So if you want to play a Targaryen yep. character, there's only like bitter steel left. That's it. <laughs> Everybody else uh, is He's technically not a Targaryen. No, but he's like close enough. He still has the vibe. Close enough. You know? We are going to be, you know, secret, secret. This is what we were working on this morning in the mod chat. But <gasps> we are going to be um, making a couple more open blurbs for three of the other great bastards. Okay. Which is what ba da Bayman. Damon is. So mm -hmm. it's just three more of the bastards, but they are ones from Aegon the Unworthy's mistress in Bravos. Mm -hmm. So for the people who are a little more interested in like, okay, I want somebody from across the sea, you'll have an option. There's okay, a reason so for this people to so be at court soon we're gonna have a few options for that yes so that would be that's awesome i love that yeah I mean, mine is is uh shira the girl i'm playing is she considered one of the great bastards i don't know because she's a girl yes. Does, is she okay. that that is why she's a player character she her mom was noble and okay so when she when Aegon died they oh wait 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 come back come back come back hold on hold on i have a joke for you oh what <laughs> It's what? very important. Why? Okay. I was waiting to find you I'm on the map. I'm ready. Okay. I'm ready. I'm here. I What's bet happening? I can tell you where you got your shoes. <laughs> can you now? <laughs> where did I get my shoes? Yes. <laughs> you got them on your feet. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> this is what I have to put up with. Once a month. <laughs> Every month for the foreseeable future. Yes. <laughs> um, I'm dying. That's what you're going to have to put up with. Karen has been encouraging me to. It actually isn't. that. Is, I lifted that wholesale from um, Dungeons and Daddies. Oh my God. If it's not it an was Eliza one of the dad joke, jokes. it's a Dungeons and Daddies joke. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh my God. I'm very happy. <laughs> Thank and hello, you. Jane. I, I How do are you doing like today? Fast exit. <laughs> Yeah, oh yes, they passed God. the hotness test. Day allows them in court. Um, so basically, anyway, the great bastards are like nine of this guy's millions and millions of bastards that were legitimized when he died because their moms were noble ladies. Mm -hmm. So he basically, oh. if she was, if she was a noble lady, he hit that. Um, he hit that real yep. good. And sometimes many, many times. And um, um... <laughs> if she was a lady, he hit that period there. Yeah. We were looking at the list and there were a couple of girls that were sent off to be septas because he had a fake marriage with a peasant lady that oh, he bought. <laughs> I like mean... this guy is awful. He never tired of the poo nanny. Like it was his hobby no. was to hit as many as he possibly could in his life. It really was. Like this guy is just the worst, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so it's really no wonder when when he died, um, every like everything just went pear shaped. <laughs> Insane. It basically. <clears throat> okay, I got so we've got a couple of those coming. I love.
love that. Okay, so there will be some options for the people that are targ hungry because we've gotten a couple of those come in like right after the last Mm -hmm. targ got taken and they've been real sad. (laughs) Yeah, which I I can understand. Targaryens are really cool. Yeah. Um, There are options. But right now it, it did just start. And if you'd like the potential later to you know, come mess shit up. Blood Raven and Damon and one of his sons managed to escape. So they could always come back later, but that's gonna be, you know, a very plot heavy you should if you're interested in that, you should come get in the RP now. Yeah, if you're interested in bitter so we know you. you should come hang out because um I am playing Bitter Steel's lover, sort of, is complicated, but we can talk about it if you're interested in him. Um, yeah, she got she got a thing going on with both Bitter Steel and Blood Raven, but Blood Raven's an NPC currently, in the moment. Yes. Blood Raven is off in Essos and Exile. Yeah, probably gathering. You know. Plans to mess everything up for the rightful (laughs) king. (laughs) I mean. Yes. Rightful. (laughs) I'm not sure Shay totally agrees. Just saying. Um, He's the one on the throne right now. So rightful. Right. I mean, like, she's. Is how we go. Survival is her goal. So, like, sure, he's allowed to think that, but. I I just Allowed. have this thing. Yeah, I just have this thing. You know, she's magic man, right? So I just have this yep. thing where I think like she was like, oh, that's not what the prediction said. They didn't say that he would win. They said he would lose. That the 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 um rebellion would not take. And then it took. So that's kind of weird, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> so yeah, we'll see how this goes. Excuse you. Yeah. Oh, and Noms is playing um, the uh, King Damon. Um, so that is our king right now. And yes. then we have his mom also. We have Dowager Queen. Bree is playing the Dowager Queen. Yes. Who? The, this. The Targaryen history is so wild. Mm-hmm. Uh, she was locked up in the Maiden Vault because her brother husband didn't want to despoil himself or his three wives (laughs) by consummating the marriage. (laughs) And she was real mad about that. She was big, big mad. I can only imagine. Oh, Jane, thank you so much for the little little Vaporeon. I love him. I love him so much. Sorry, I just hear Eliza howling. Out in the living room, and I'm very concerned. (laughs) Do you need to go check on her? Nope. I want my mother in law is up. She's got her, but I also, you know, feel sorry for my poor mother in law (laughs) who might be uh, sleepy. Oh, yeah, considering, you know, she's in recovery, so she's in recovery, and Eliza (laughs) is trying real hard to not be tired. <laughs> Maybe Eliza should go take a nap. I can't, I was trying <laughs> for about an hour. <laughs> that is a losing battle, my friend. <laughs> so, in other exciting Kendra news, um, I ate all my Girl Scout cookies, Kendra, and I'm waiting already. For, um, oh my goodness! Y- yeah, and so now I'm waiting for my box of Samoas. I know you guys got them and are working on that. We did get them that it because I'm in town by the good post office. I'm like, yes, okay, let me get the shipping. I've got them in my car. Oh, nice. Just nice. for you. Yay, I'm so excited. Yay. I love Samoas. Yes, I honestly, I have no idea why they couldn't be shipped. Yeah, it's weird. First. I mean, I, I, I don't understand either why those yeah, ones were special, know. why they had to come to you. There were two weeks where you could have them shipped. Yeah, and then it would disappeared. Like, yeah, it was weird. And now nothing can be shipped, and it's all back to um, online or in-person delivery. They should have kept the online, honestly. Like, 
There's yeah, no way that, that they didn't make a butt ton of money that from that. That is the way to do these. Yeah. These yeah, Naomi, go take a shower. Orders. You smell. God. I smell you from P-U. here. P-U-E. <laughs> pew, pew, pew. So I'm excited for my Samoas because the other cookies are gone. I had a box oh, of man. lemon ones and I had a box of thin mints. Oh, the lemon ones are Eliza's favorite. They're so good. They're so I'm good. I'm just shocked that she wanted lemon ones. Mmm. That seems like an odd choice to me for a child. Yeah, I don't know. I actually went through a phase where I loved, loved sour things. Like, I mean, you know I love french fries, right? And I went through a phase yeah. where I just wanted to put salt and lemon juice all over my french fries. Um, Excuse and eat me? them like that. Yeah, it was amazing. It was amazing. It was like a whole thing. And I would like eat the lemon. Like, I would eat the lemon afterwards, like the pulp of it, after I juiced it. Yes, that's me, honey. Say hi, Eliza. Hi, Eliza. Jane. <laughs> Every fucking stream Jane shows up to... She goes, hi, I'm new to the stream. That's fair. Jane. Jane. You're not, a new, you're not new every time. Yes, yeah, she is. <laughs> it's winter in here. It is winter in here. Where's yeah. the box? No, we don't have any because it's winter. Oh, your box will be pink. Oh, wait, we do have some. Why do we have, why are they growing outside, by the way? Oh, those are, those are the winter seeds specifically. Ah. Well, why this of a tin? Is that someone who's mummified? No, that's not someone who's mummified. I thought that's what she said. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah. No, uh, Eliza, but I'm mummified. Me. Hi. Oh. Can she see me? Or does no. she just see the game? She just sees the game. Oh, okay. She also can't hear you. <laughs> oh. Whatever. Everyone can hear me. Everyone can hear me. <laughs> Okay. Okay, here. Uh, maybe, but oh, watch out, watch out. There you go. Okay. I need you to close the door, please, kiddo. Bye. Okay, give me one second. She needs Mario Kart. Okay. You know, I should probably go try to beat the one thing to get the, the golden scythe. Maybe I should try to do that for today. Go get my sword. Oh, there's Kendra. Okay, get my obsidian sword. And we'll go this way. Naomi, what have you been up to? BT dubs. Someday you get Stardew with us, right? <laughs> Oh my gosh, thank you so much for the howl, Lunar. I don't even have to look. I know that was you. I know that was you, my howling friend. Y'all, Lunar has the coolest, um, the coolest legacy challenge that she's doing in Sims 4 right now. She's doing a Taylor Swift legacy challenge where every single generation is based off of an era of Taylor Swift. I don't know anything about Taylor Swift, but I do know that we could not find the hospital and it was um, very amusing. So we built a hospital, but then all of a sudden, our the Taylor Swift sim didn't need the hospital no more. She was like, now that we found it, and now that we built it, um, I'm better now, actually. Thanks. Oh my That's god, these fair. things are killing me. Uh-oh. I don't think I what can What level are you on? Um, I went into the one little area where at the end you get the golden scythe, but I think my battling oh. is like not even close to leveled up enough, because I almost just died. So maybe we'll do that later. It did have a sign with a skull on it that warned me. I just ignored that, um, thinking that I was too cool for school. You're better than that sign. <laughs> That's what I thought, but I was Obviously. wrong. What is my what is my combat even at? Oh, my combat's That's only at four. Maybe question. that's why. <laughs> that would be why. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. Oh, my combat's um, at three. Okay. Let's go to the mines. To that was so stressful, right? It looks stressful to me. Lunar, I was I was lurking the whole time, but I will tell you, I had to um, eat dinner during it, so I kept dozing off. I was really tired last night, so I kept falling Aww. asleep. I kept falling asleep like after work, like starting at like five thirty. <laughs> I kept falling asleep in my chair, but uh, <sighs> but Lunar was there with the uh, Swift AC, the Swift Legacy, 
uh, so that I that's had some amazing while I was sleeping. Yeah, it was awesome. Oh, I didn't mean to click town. I meant to click bus stop. Do we have any food? A good oh, question. I'm getting attacked. What's attacking me? me. Ah, it's me. Hi. You're the problem. It's you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I still tell that joke at work. And people stop, don't get it so much anymore. At first, what? people were laughing like all the time because it was like you know, uh, that was the song. But yeah. people stopped laughing recently, and they just stare at me now. So I think this the the, the meme is the meme is done. The normies aren't no. laughing anymore. Well, that's their problem. Not I know. Not mine. I think it's still funny personally. It is. But we have a fish taco. Wait, is that saved for something? I don't think so okay i'm gonna eat it that might be a garbage fish taco that's okay i don't I know eat it in kitty's that... honor kitty couldn't be here today obviously since she's not here she was busy doing Rip. real life stuff gross Rude. who does that Ugh. gosh thinking of putting it on she? youtube girl you should i sing that down the hallway at school and they don't <laughs> Look to see who it is. I believe you, Lunar. You should, okay? You should because watching um, Sims Let's Plays, I will tell you, what, problem number one, they don't get a lot of views. Problem number two, because of the way the music is in The Sims, um, when you like play an instrument or do the radio or whatever, you know, because it's a simlish version of, of real songs a lot of times. You can't, it, it doesn't like to monetize them. Like a lot of my Sims videos actually have monetization turned off on them. But... Despite all that, that is what I like to watch personally when I just want some good background noise. <laughs> and so I will put on like random YouTubers Sims pl playlists and just play them in the background for hours. So I think you should do it. Okay. Mm. Oh, I have exciting news for you guys also. Oh, I have something to tell you. OK, so subscribers already saw like a little bit of this but um but not everyone knows so starting next week we're gonna be doing stream we're gonna do streams a little bit differently next week because y'all um i want to say thank you for 400 followers so for the thank you for 400 followers um we are gonna be spending a week so it starts on thursday and it goes all the way to the next wednesday spending a week attempting to 100 percent Final Fantasy X-2. I have never ever beaten this game before, let alone 100 percented it. I have no idea if this is even physically possible or if I've given myself an impossible task, but we're going to try to do it. Okay, we're going to try 100 percent Ten two. Thank you, Kendra. I believe in me too. Um, and we're going to basically be streaming the whole week. So whenever I'm up and feel like streaming, we're going to be streaming. So you should pop by Ooh. all kinds of different times. I'm going to be here. Um, mm -hmm. so, so yeah, when I'm, when I'm not streaming, like we might turn off the stream. It just depends, but I might leave it on. Like if I'm going to take a break, that's going to be long. I might leave it on. And instead, like I've got a playlist of my favorite video essays. So you guys have something to watch while I'm like eating dinner or whatever. So we're going to do that. And then also, instead of just um, doing the pins when you guys subscribe, uh, in addition to that, what we're going to do is a whole bunch of different things. And I have this wheel, and you can dry erase on it. Okay, and then I can spin the wheel. That's what the wheel is for. Yes, I was so waiting. you saw it in the background, and you can... There, there's a reason for this. Yes, okay, so then it will land on something, and then we'll do it. Okay, let me show you all some of the fun things I've got. One of them is going to be sprinkling catnip, the catnip that Kitty bought us for the the purty. Um, also, I got that the bean boozled game. Okay, so Aww. we'll eat nasty jelly beans. That's going to be very fun. Also, I got a you're so brave. Of fifteen hundred mini stickers, and I'll stick stickers to my face. See, hello, Aww. Kitty. Mini stickers. And then. <gasps> I don't know. Whatever else y'all want. Like, I'm open to other ideas, too. I made a list. Um, you'll see when I advertise it. I ever, I'm going to advertise this on Monday, so you'll see the list that I made. But I'm open to other ideas, too, if there's other goofy things y'all want to see me do when you subscribe during that week. Goofy. I like how goofy is um, <laughs> suggested. <laughs> so far, the, all the ideas I have right now are pretty goofy. I mean... Let's be real. Is that Lucas? Yes. Well, Hello, the, the Lucas. first one was. The second one was me. Oh. 
<laughs> I figured you were mimicking, mimicking him. I, I do like to mimic. Yes. Ah. So anyway, that's what I'm doing for my thank you for 400, 400 followers. This was kind of born off of like Lunar said, you should do a 24 hour stream. And I thought, absolutely the fuck not. I will never, ever do that. <laughs> the 12 hours was too much, but I can commit to like a week of regular daily streaming. And I feel like that's a good happy medium um, yes. between that desire and uh, and what I can actually do. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for the lurk, Jane. We love our lurkers here. Yes. Also, hi, Bonesaw. 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 I love that nickname. I love Me that too. So <laughs> it's just, it's so perfect. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Hello. Hi, buddy. I know. Okay. Well, seeing how bad my combat was... I guess I should actually practice my combat. Yeah. Come on back to the mine. I know, buddy. Yeah. Oh, boy. Oh. Now don't you start. Now don't I you start. I love his noises, though. They're so fucking cute. Uh, you, you say that. Yeah, I know. I don't have to hear them all the time. I only have to hear them sometimes. But that is not the point. They're so fucking cute. Is 120 the final floor of the mines? Did we get all the way down? I'm not sure. I can't remember what the final floor is. I think we did. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna go down here and just start and fight things. Okay. I will come Bitch. find you after I water. In the greenhouse. Okay. Thank you for keeping up with that. I have not been I stream so far. Enjoy the greenhouse a little too much. <laughs> I I love spending. Okay, so I haven't done it in this one because it gets fucking manic, and I'm not gonna put you guys through the insanity. But I love uh -huh. just like over organizing the greenhouse so that it has like a little bit of everything, and it looks like really beautiful and aesthetic in there. Um, yes. I love doing that. Uh, but it's insane, I recognize, so I would not put you guys through <laughs> forcing you to do my aesthetic greenhouse, but yeah, in my solo games, that's what I like to do. That's adorable. Hyper-organized, hyper-aesthetic greenhouse. Uh, okay, we need Why didn't beans. I bring any food into the mines? Because I'm dumb. I knew I was going to be fighting things, but, you know, I also didn't bring food. You know, I've got a parsnip I can give to you. A parsnip. <laughs> parsnip. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> I guess it's more food than what I brought, so, you know, beggars can't I have can't a parsnip choosers. and some peppers. <laughs> this bitch. Limes take too long to die. Oh my god. I think I went down too far. I should uh -oh. have not gone down so far into the mines. We dug too deep. Okay. Aw. Okay, I just should have brought food if I was going to go this far down. Did I even really get much on, more on my combat? No. I, have t I didn't. I don't think. That's okay. At least well, I tried. Okay. What level are you at? I'm coming. I'm four. Coming. I'm at freaking four, and my health You're... is already too low, so I gotta go. Really? Yeah. Um. The dwarf scrolls. There's a. We need more dwarf scrolls than than just if the museum. Like, there's reason to have them, right? Should I? I've got a dwarf scroll number two. I'm trying to figure out if I should keep it. If I, I shouldn't think... sell it. Uh, just sell it. If we need it, we can always come find one. Okay, because I want to, I figure, I thought there was, like, reason to keep, and I can't remember, but I thought there was, like, reasons to have more than I one. I think you can build things, things with them, but oh my goodness. You can build things with them? I don't remember this. Yeah, like the computers and stuff. Oh. 
Okay, maybe that's why I'm thinking yeah. that I should hang on to this or something. I chose a, a higher floor this time so that I could live longer. <laughs> Oh my goodness, my little sister really, like, she just will stim by saying random things over and over again, and the bluey, ah, can we get the bill, was one for a while, and Eliza <laughs> thought it was the funniest thing, so now she'll just, Agree. very high-pitched, Oh, can we get that bill? Over and over and over and over. <laughs> that sounds like exactly the kind of stim to drive Kendra crazy. It is. <laughs> it 100% is. Okay, but like, I'm definitely on Eliza's side with this. Like, that's the kind of thing I like to do. Like, just random words or random singing oh. or make things into songs. And then, yeah, like, see? when you like one, it gets stuck in your head forever. And then you it have does. to do it 50 times. And I do the same thing. Mm-hmm. But the difference is I'm doing it. <laughs> That's hypocritical, Kendra. <laughs> I know. I am well aware. <laughs> secret note, secret note. Oh. I learned secret a secret. Secret letter. I learned a secret. I was really hoping that I already found the secret letter to up my luck. Because we've got a rabbit's foot. Oh, yeah, we do. But I don't have that secret note yet. Aw, I'm sorry. I went to the truck and I was like, hey. The truck said nothing. You have to find the note first? I think so. Oh, okay. I couldn't remember. I, I, well, maybe it's a mod or something. I thought you could, like, do the secrets even if you hadn't found the note yet. But maybe I not. thought so too, but maybe not in multiplayer. I, like, I don't know. Oh. It's been a long time since I've restarted a game me too that's why like i'm not 100 percent sure about certain things because it's just been so long since i've played year one like i really only play year one when i'm streaming with you guys yeah. so like <laughs> um no Ooh, my guy. yeah my other save files like are several years past so i've done like, yeah all the i've stuff. i've done them met the island like yeah exactly Oh my goodness. I went down a YouTube rabbit hole last night on the Zelda trailer breakdown. Oh my god. Okay, so as as our resident I, Breath of the Wild expert, so ridiculous. tell us all of your thoughts. Um, It looks great. Yeah. I am really excited to see how they do it because they've changed the like verbs of the game so instead of the you know Sheikah slate things and being able to do your remote bombs and all of that you have your cool magic hand mm -hmm. and you do stuff with your magic hand like mm -hmm. go through ceilings mm -hmm. and stick things to each other mm -hmm. to make boats and or Gundams? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it seems that way. Um, it was the most wild thing that I've ever seen in a Zelda trailer. Is it just the random Gundam that Link was piloting? It's giving like, okay. spirit tracks, honestly. It It's pretty cool. Um, and then seeing all of the different tiers, having, you know, some flashbacks to Skyward Sword and the awful Silent Realm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, uh -huh. mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And and those trials, it's giving those flashbacks a lot mm -hmm. with the tears. It is, it is a little bit. Um, a little bit, but yeah. that's, I think, exciting. I'm excited to see it. So my big theory is that um, Ganon's not the bad guy here. <laughs> what? Is this like a real thing you think or is this like a wish you have? This is a real thing I think. 
Okay. Tell um, me more. Tell me your justification. And it, I'm not the only one who has decided this. Okay. Okay. Tell which me. Which is the funniest part. Oh, hi. Hello. Um, <laughs> because when we first see Ganon in this latest, tra- I don't need to water the tree. Um, <laughs> oh, my inventory is full. That's why I can't pick that up. Um, he is. He looks exactly like Demise, mm. which we know he's the reincarnation and all of that. But from the tapestry in Breath of the Wild, the champion doesn't look like Link mm. mm-hmm. in that tapestry. He has the same color pattern as Ganon. Hmm. So there's a theory going around that one reincarnation uh, after dealing with the um, that being sealed away in either Wind Waker or Twilight Princess that the uh, Triforce of Power what saved him but his reincarnation did something to give up that triforce Mm -hmm. or reject it or redeem it or something so that he was freed from that part of the cycle Mm -hmm. and the whole big theory is that oh what's his face Um, demise has been the the reason why Ganon has one survived and two is bad and Ganon will be possessed. Mm-hmm. Okay. I mean, it's definitely a very modern it's, idea in uh, like why not kind I mean, of theory. Like they already change so much with the Zelda formula. Like, Mm-mm. I don't know. I guess, yeah, why not? Maybe. Why not? Yeah. Uh, if you're going to do it, now would be the Ganon's time. Or Ganon's going to be a mini boss, basically. Yeah, I mean, that's what I think. <laughs> but, you know, who knows? Uh, I'm a but you can the take Sidon in so. with us. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so excited. Hi. And I just know that Eliza's about to change her... Uh, Zelda costume request to her, Zelda's new Zonai dress. I mean, her new dress is like fire. Like, I love it. I love it's the look. It's so cool. I love how it's like kind of like ancient-y looking. Um, I think it looks really cool. And then, I, I don't know. I think that the lady wearing the same thing that Zelda's wearing is a flashback. Right? Like, I feel like there's got to be, like, some timeline nonsense going on here. Um, there has for to that be. Reason. That, the throne room, the bird goat man. Yeah. Has to be. I agree. Yeah. Thank you for the lurk, Nom. has to be. We love our lurkers Yay. here. And I think someone else did, too. A lunar did, too. Yes. Thank you for the, thank you for the lurk, lunar. I hope you get some good, delicious food. Yum. Mm-hmm. I just so I don't plan to play it but I plan to bully Kendra into (laughs) either streaming it on discord or twitch or something so I can watch her play it um so yeah oh George was my friend okay I forgot who my person was it was George oh me too Robin's mine okay Okay, George likes peppers, right? We have... Oh, I just ate the pepper, didn't he, I? No, there's another leeks. pepper. He likes leeks. We don't have a leek. We have pepper. No, we don't have a leek. Um, I think he likes peppers. Uh, I think he also we, likes honey. Do we have honey or have we sold... I think we might have sold it all. Trying to get money, money. Yeah, I'm going to just give him this pepper. If he doesn't like it, then he can fuck off. Yeah. I have so many quests. Oh, my God. Rude. 
My gift taste helper mod isn't working all of a sudden. Oh no, I did have a lot of mod updates. I saw that as well for mine too. I, I think that mod author has stopped modding for Stardew. Yeah, another one of I my think favorites is going to break event break next time S Mappy does an update too. The um the one yeah. that makes all the different honeys different colors and stuff. Aww. And the wines different colors yeah. like that one. <sighs> it's going to break. I'm so sad. Queen loves us. Oh, baby. <laughs> Just a sweet little No, oh, there's update. a bunch of jelly uh, in oh. here. Do you think do people like jelly? Yeah, they like artisan crafts. Sorry, I'm just cows, gonna, I forgot to feed you. I'm just gonna take this jelly then. Because we have a lot of it. So this will be my gift. I'll put it down here in the corner so yeah. I don't forget. Let's see, what are we doing on? We have wine too. So there's two There's two wines in here. Do you want a wine or a jelly or okay, should I? Go. I'm gonna no, sell the ones I, you don't want. No, I have want. an extra diamond. Okay. I'm gonna sell these wines and jellies then. I need to see how much the next house upgrade is because we need that. Desperately. Yeah, we need the uh, base cement. We've got quite a bit of mayonnaise that's going to be popped in to sell today. Okay. I'm gonna sell all this extra artesian goods. Okay. Oh, we got a pumpkin. A pumpkin, yay. A pumpkin, a pumpkin. We got a pumpkin. All right, how did you get the Kleenex box on your foot? <laughs> That's where it goes, how Mom. How did you do that? That's where it goes, Mom. <laughs> Kleenex box goes yes, on foot. Obviously. That's where it belongs. You know, silly me. Yeah. Now you know. Now you've been yeah, educated. Now I know. So. Where are my skills? Oh, those uh, geodes were dumb. They just gave me rocks. Rude. I know, right? All right, let's go check out. Let's go talk to Robin. I want to see how much the next house upgrade is. I have rubber, rubber. Robin. And Yanya? Have a calculator. That's yeah. a good toy. It's a great toy. Okay, let's do upgrade house. Okay, Calculators, a... Kleenex boxes. Yeah, we need a, a hundred G's. That's a oh, lot of G's. A lot that of is. G's. Wait, do we need, I want to check this one too. Deluxe barn. Okay, we have. Do we? Did we ever upgrade our barn? No, we need to. We need the barn upgrade. Okay, so we need the barn upgrade. So the barn upgrade, we have the the amount of money for it, but we need five fifty wood and three hundred stone. I'm sure we have three hundred stone, but there's no way we don't have five fifty wood. I think we're waiting for winter to end so we can get more wood for that one. Yeah. Okay, so I think that was the the goal is upgrade the house. As well as upgrade the barn, but we could not do either yet because we don't have wood and we don't have enough money. So we need money and wood. That's got to be the priority. All right. Okay. Now I know. I said it out loud, so I'll remember it. Uh, yeah, you think? <laughs> That's what I tell myself. Hold on, buddy. I'm trying to kill some slimes. Get them. Uh oh. Okay, uh oh. So let's do. And you should also take some time to upgrade your tools, Kendra. I'm going through and trying to upgrade some of my tools, too. Like, I think we should all try to get gold tools at this point. We're far enough down in the mines. That's what we should have. I just got my watering can back. <laughs> I'm about to go give him my watering can again so I can get a gold one. Yeah, I think, no, do I want yeah. a gold axe? No, mm, it's the 24th. Yeah, let's get the gold axe and I'll get the gold watering can next. <clears throat> so 
So Kendra, I heard that you had a ghost story for us. Oh, the ghost story. Yes. Yes. Um, I went to go visit my old boss and show off my baby. Have a milkshake. So She's a family friend. So cute. So it's like, okay, hey, let's go over and see her. And as soon as I walked into the hotel and got up the stairs, my... You know that feeling when you stick a Q-tip in your ear and it feels just a little bit too good? Yeah. Yeah. So my ears got that feeling and my teeth started, like, my behind my nose and above my teeth. It's just a weird feeling that I get. And it's one of those things that sounds absolutely mental. And I would have never thought, but it was the, like, hey, where have you been? I got a stern talking to where have you been kendra the ghosts missed you they were like hey what's going on get back over here but the saddest part hi yeah was that the little girl ghost in one of the rooms wasn't there anymore oh she moved and on. that room was just completely like when a loud sound happens and you like your ears kind of pop and there's just that silence that you can feel. Mm -hmm. You walk into that room and it was just that. Mm. It was so sad. I was like, oh, do you think my friend when Lucas gets older that you'll want to go back to that job? I feel like you liked it a lot. I already want to go back to that job. <laughs> I kind of need to go back to that job. Or uh, so when when you're able yeah. to when Lucas is when, old enough for you to be able to, right? Yeah, that's that's the plan. I'm hoping this summer, like it's, we're gonna have to make something work because we gotta go back to two incomes. Yeah, I know. I totally understand. And you have family there to support you, so I feel like there's got to be some solution yes. to this. You know, I'm hopeful. Uh, if nothing else, Matt should be having uh, people return from college this summer that mm -hmm, are actually mm -hmm. reliable and so he'll have more good work. workers yeah for at least a few months mm -hmm. which is when like i will need to be there mm -hmm. oh bloody. my gosh you want to offer promotion my on my channel amazing oh my god yeah, oh, that sounds so cool oh boy where's the fucking button i always forget uh, yes. where the button is um you bully. I think you have successfully bullied Matthew into getting the capture card, and he, uh, because we have an old desktop that needs to be, you know, updated. It's one that he built a while ago. Yeah, yeah. I know that that was, I know, Ooh. I mean, I, the, obviously the pregnancy was the real reason, but part of the reason the stream stopped is because of like, well, we really need to upgrade the desktop also. Yeah. Yeah. The pregnancy was the main thing. Yeah, but, but I know there was also uh, extenuating circumstances, which is why I haven't started yes. back up again. Yeah. Hi. Uh, mostly because, you know, when I sit down, he wakes up. Yes. Which is why every Stardew stream lately we hear the babbles, which are very cute, and I love them. As long as he's doing happy babbles, I'm fine. Yeah. I and so know. far for Stardew, he does happy babbles, so. Usually. Yeah. I'm pretty good at muting when, when we go sideways there yeah and it's not been too much at least and when no. I, at least the mutes that i notice have not been super frequent <laughs> i don't know maybe he's the chewing me out right now thing. but oh <laughs> well we can't really but hear that's it. okay it's, it sounds like cute babbles on this side it's good <laughs> i know yeah i know so it, it seems like matt have some big plans for the computer because I made the joke of yeah, baby of the wild streams. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. You know, oh stick a little God. green hat on him when he's in the carrier. Yes, and, you know, I'm pretty. We keep our kids off of the internet. We're responsible that way. Right. Um, but if we stick a little hat on him. Yes. Aha. Uh -huh. Also, like, he's so young at this point. Like, I don't know. Yeah. I like His to, face is going to change. Right. Like, to me, pre-talking, pre, pre -talking, like, it's okay. 
But like once they start talking, I think there's like this time period where you then need to wait a while before you start putting Mm -hmm. them back on the Internet again. Um, Yes. Because they're kind of like, I don't know when before they talk, they're just just different. Like they're not fully themselves yet. I know mm-hmm. that sounds like super fucking weird, but that is how no, it seems no, to me. No, no, I understand. <laughs> yeah. So like it when is, they're baby I babies, it. I think it's okay. Um, but then once they get to talking age, it's like, okay, well now maybe it's a little bit weird. <laughs> oh my God, that would be so cute. That would be so cute. Right? Oh, there's real queen. There's real. Hi, hi queen. Yay. Oh. It's queen. <laughs> <clears throat> ah, la, la, la. I don't well, think I your mean, sock I... is gonna taste good. Oh yay, combat. Santa. Oh, you got a combat upgrade? I did. I got oh, to good. level four combat. Oh good. So you're matching me now. Yes. <laughs> Hello, anime. How are you doing today? <laughs> hey, we talked about let's like just do the one because the spamming was starting to annoy people. So let's just you can do that, but like let's do one instead of multiples. <laughs> um what was I saying? I was saying something. I forgot what I was saying. I know. Lucas has Here lots to say. He, he's a very talkative <laughs> guy. <laughs> he lets us know what's what. I mean he has to be a very talkative guy because of <laughs> His sister. I know, right? His sister talks often. So he he's learning early that uh, to get a word in, you just have to like. You, you just, just have, have to, to go. Talk. You just have to go. Yes. <laughs> yep. Don't wait. Just go. Yep. Or it's not going to happen. Yeah. Which is fine. Mm-hmm. He it's better. Talk. It's better than not talking. Honestly, like I really think it's better. Yeah. I'm okay. fine with it. She tells silly. She has decided she has an older sister who lives in Montana. Okay. Um, has drawn this sister in pictures when the assignment is draw everyone who lives in your house and talks about her so confidently that teachers, bus drivers have asked, like, hey, she's talking about it. Is this because I didn't think this was the case, but is it? I'm like, no. Oh, gosh. No, kiddo. Honey, you uh, gotta... That mom is solid here. She's uh, she's very imaginative. That's... Yeah. Ugh. You know, I've heard of this before, though. Kids doing this, where they invent siblings that don't exist. Yeah. Um, out of, like... It's as, like, a creative outlet thing that they're doing. You yeah. Know? So she just really wants a big sister. She wants to fit in with her friends who are younger siblings. Yeah, um, well, Eliza, you know, time travel has not been invented yet, so you not can't yet. have an older sister. <laughs> not yet. Sorry. Oh, the feast is beginning. It's beginning. Oh, I forgot that was today. Whoop. Yes. Get your gift. Don't get your gift before you come on. I've got it. Okay. Let's go. We. Oh, my goodness. I gotta find beep, George. Beep, <clears throat> okay. Start talking to everybody. Yep. You have to talk to everybody. It's very important. Uh, okay, Pam. No thanks. If you look I'm at sorry, the stream, Willie. you can see all of their holiday outfits since I have that holiday outfit mod. I don't know if you ever got that one. Um, I didn't. But they're so cute. Do you want to hear the legend of the Winter Star? Yeah, tell me, Willie. <clears throat> it's all about the star drops. Linus's winter outfit, his uh, Christmas outfit, looks just like the ghost of a uh, Christmas uh, past or future. I don't know. Whatever one's like the usually the fat jolly ghost in the um, adaptations. He looks like that. It looks so cool. Even Shane is festive. Shane, I love your Christmas sweater. Oh, Harvey got red scarf. So cute. Oh, Leia's is beautiful. She's got like a little hoodie shawl thing. 
Elliot looking dapper. And then... Uh, what do I hope to find under the spirit tree? I think maybe a jug of spiced mead. That's what I would like. Don't that worry, Emily. Delicious. I'll give you a taste. Yeah, right. I still did. I tell you? Did I tell you that I had feel that I had to stop drinking because of the ocular migraines? Did I tell you the ocular migraine story? No. Okay, I think this That's is awful. while you were. Yeah, I think this is while you were too pregnant to function. Um, so it was over a Super Bowl party that it, the last one happened. But basically, drinking oh. alcohol was triggering ocular migraines for me, and um, oh, and it man. happened. Yeah, it happened at the Super Bowl party, and my parents happened to be there. And uh, my mom was like, "Oh yeah, that runs in our family, and this is what it is, and da 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 da, and all this stuff." And oh. um, so I was like, "Huh, okay." So I stopped drinking since then, and um, it has uh, it has stopped happening. I've not triggered one since, so I'm oh, now that's annoying to start drinking again, uh, even as much as I would like to. Um, I, I, I don't know when I'm going to try to start again, but it's probably going to be a while, but yeah, so that's a thing. That's rough. Yeah, it was really rough. It's just annoying. Yep. Yeah, it was Minus. very annoying. Oh, Penny was mine. Oh, yay. What did you get me, girl? I know. Yeah, thanks, Penny. Okay, yes, I'll open it. She has on a tacky Christmas sweater that looks like it lights up. Deluxe speed That's pro. That's perfect. Nice. Elliot was mine. Oh, oh my God, Kendra. That's so sweet. It's a meet cute. It is a meet cute. Yay. Yay. Hi, oh Kendra. My God. I'm what your secret you? gift giver this year. Here, open it. Let's see what, it, what I'm worried now. What oh, he got me you? wine. Oh, thanks, buddy. Elliot, thanks. That's good. That's good. It's not much, but I hope you like it. Hey, anime. Remember, we said we're gonna limit those messages, so I don't want to like time you out or anything. But let's limit those messages. So we want to like, you know, if you you can talk to us, but like we don't want the spammy messages so much. Okay. I forgot what's at the Christmas shop. Okay, we can get... Um... Lily, you're in my way. Just Christmas looking stuff. Okay. I understand. I understand. I appreciate that. Blah, 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 blah. It's, it's all good. Is there anybody hiding down here for the Christmas time? I don't think that there is. I don't think so. I went down and I looked around. And I didn't find anybody. Yeah, I don't think they are. Even though you can get to, like, Emily and Haley's house and some things. Or Emily's house. Um, I don't think that there's anybody there. And then they've got that blocked off. Okay. I think that's it. Yeah, okay, so I talked to everybody. I didn't really see anything worth buying. And uh, yeah, we got Speed Grow. Yay! So that'll be good. That We can use that um, when the spring starts because we still haven't gotten freaking red cabbage, whatever that one is. We never got it. Well, um, but we don't get the seeds until... Yeah, but sometimes you can get them from the witch, the traveling merchant lady. Ah, uh, yeah. Um... And then we need pomegranate. We we have the rabbit's foot. We need to go turn that in. Okay, so let's put the speed. Oh, up. sorry. I can't pet the ducks. They're sleeping. <laughs> yeah. I stop know. trying to wake them up. I'm oh, trying gosh. to get the eggs there that they're sleeping by. <laughs> they're in my way. I understand. We need that mayonnaise. Yes, we do. That is how we're going to get our upgrades. That's right. Quick, quick, quick. Quick little feet. Run, run, run. Although it's not too much um, longer before the end of the season and then we get to switch over to spring. Potato. Mm. 
There we go. We're having, ah. I think we might be having mashed potatoes today. I don't know. We have a bunch of rice in there, but Levi was like, but I really want mashed potatoes. So he's deciding if we're having mashed potatoes or we're having rice um, <laughs> with the gravy. I don't know which it's going to be. But it's probably going to be mashed potatoes. There's a cracker. Yeah. I want a cracker, oh Mom. I, so... He really enjoys food now, mm. but he will bodily throw himself at whatever I'm eating. <laughs> what? He just launches himself so he can get it. Oh my god. If I'm eating something and holding him in the other arm, I have lost my bagel to him before. What the heck? Uh, I was try I was trying to keep my garlic bread away from him because I thought, yeah, you know, you're not even six months. You don't need any garlic bread. And he said, no, actually, I definitely do. <laughs> and just flew across my body for it. And he was so happy. Oh, my God. That okay. is adorable, though. Well, and Ritz are fun because we get to make a mushy. Yeah. It's not my favorite part. <laughs> but. Huh. Makes it happy. Chomp, chomp, chomp. He's going to be such a good, um, a good kid for eating. If he's like already interested in food at six months. Uh, a lot of kids are, but you, they uh, back off and get picky at around three. Oh, boo. Yeah, it's a pretty common toddler thing. Is your taste buds are changing and there's a control. You know. I don't think I ever was picky with food as a kid. I think I always liked all kinds of food. Unless your parents are lucky. Yeah, I don't I don't remember. I remember my sister being very picky when we were growing up, but I don't have any memories where like I was picky myself or I was served things I didn't like or stuff like that. Like I just I mean maybe I was and I just don't remember it, but I I truly don't. And usually I want to make fish stew, but I need an albacore. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I'm going to go try to catch the again. albacore. Uh, well, cuz if you don't do it now, you got to wait all the way till fall, so I'm going to go try to catch the albacore in a minute. <laughs> Okay. But I gotta go get my golden axe first. Yeah, I should upgrade another tool. You should. While I'm here. Wee. I know, I know. Sorry. Bouncy, bouncy. Let's bouncy guy. The watering can next. Okay. Mm. Well, Eliza oh, used to snack on green beans. Just constantly. That I know you're- I want to- mm. yeah. I guess I can't process geodes while he's working on my watering can. Whatever. No, he- I, it's very sad. Clint, you- you can do more than one thing at a time. Uh, no, he can't. He's Clint. <laughs> okay, well that's true. <laughs> Sorry, that might have been me. No, but it's, it's true, true though. It's true. But what it might have been What character in Stardew is more annoying than Clint? There are none. <laughs> Clint yeah. is the most annoying. Hey, Blue, thank you so much. Thank you so much. We are having good luck. We're um we're pretty close to the end of the first year. We're about to start the second year pretty soon. That's Let's see so if we exciting. Can catch an we need albacore luck right. right now. Let's make some cheese. Put the pail back into the bucket. Yes. <laughs> How We're many freaking milk pails have we bought because they end up in people's inventories? I can't. I don't know. <laughs> You're binging Too the Harry many. Potter films. Um, and Blue, I'm sure you saw that they're making the uh, the Harry Potter. Uh, they're making Harry Potter a HBO TV show. I don't hate you, Blue. I don't hate you. It's okay. Um, and uh, and nobody wants it. Not a single person is interested or hype about this. <laughs> Kendra, no, did you I... see that? Of course I saw it. My I'm god, why? Uh because every you know main actor came out. Yeah. Like this was like 2 days after Daniel Radcliffe did his like trans voices. Yes. Talk show. Yes. And then the turfs like, felt it, the need to attack him cuz his girlfriend is taller than him. 
It's like right. Yeah, I was um, like, what? So stupid. It's so weird. So it's it's not surprising. It's it feels like a move to separate uh people to get people who aren't um actively criticizing her yeah i think that's part of it and also just the more stuff you make the more like you can keep the rights to the ip so i think there's some of that in it for yeah. warner brothers um blue yeah i have heard like some trepidatious excitement from some people that want another depiction of the books but here's why like because i would also like another depiction of the books but they advertised this as being incredibly book accurate. And that's why I'm like, okay, but that's not what I really want. The movies are already incredibly book accurate. So I just don't understand why we need a TV show when we already have the books and the movies both being, you know, very close together. Um, I just feel like if we we're going to have a TV show, I would rather have it be like an Dated adaptation you know what I mean like mm -hmm. um like Harry Potter but in the 2020s or like Harry Potter but fixing some of the plot holes or like you know what I mean like that Harry I Potter but be... Hermione doesn't get <laughs> for thinking slavery is bad <laughs> right so like stuff like that you know I think a tv show Harry Potter tv show with that type of thing as its goal like an adaptation that isn't afraid to change stuff might be like interesting and something that I might truly want to see. Whereas this, um, dang it, it's a regular tuna. I thought I got the alpha form. Whereas like this, it's like book accurate. I'm just like, why wouldn't you just watch the movies if you want like something that's particularly book accurate? Those are very book accurate movies uh, for movies. You know what I mean? So that's because I'm, like, we didn't mm. get the death day party. That's why so dumb it's so dumb milking an ip and jk wants to pat her wallet right like she doesn't have enough fucking money yeah trepidatious that's the right anime exactly i that's why i feel like that about it so i don't know like i mean i'm not gonna lie i'm not above it okay i'm not perfect i'm gonna check it out when it releases okay i'm not gonna pretend like i'm not going to like i'm going to you know what i mean but i have low expectations very low expectations some people don't believe the films are really faithful to the books. Those people are stupid. Sorry. They are. Four films, like, <laughs> taking those books and putting them into the film medium. Like, that's some of the most accurate adaptations that exist in <laughs> on this planet. You know, it's a different medium, so they have to change some things. But, like, the amount of stuff that they changed is so minimal compared to other adaptations. Like, it's insane. So, like, sorry, they're wrong. <laughs> Kendra, let you laugh and make no comment because you know I'm just totally right. I yeah, I I don't have anything to add. <laughs> yeah, and because I'm objectively correct. I mean, I think so. <laughs> and I just think like if you want to tackle the few the few ways in which the movies are different from the books, it's too soon. Like, it's too soon for your next adaptation to be like, we're doing the book accurate one now. Like, why? Why? Exactly. Lucas, it's very upsetting and it's very annoying because they're doing it for the money, 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 not because they actually care about the IP or that they care about the artistry. It's because they yeah. know people will watch it. Mm -hmm. Was their game sold very well, fought against all expectations, right? And honestly, like, the game's pretty good. Like, it's got a lot of the same problems that modern Western RPGs have, but it's still a pretty good modern Western RPG, right? Um, and, like, when it comes out for Switch, I might pick it up. Like, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. Like, you know what I mean? Because there's parts of it that seem cool. Like, the side characters and the voice acting all seem really good. Um, so, you know... Lucas has very strong Harry Potter opinions, I see. Oh, we're muted. Okay. Yeah, uh, I agree, Lucas. You're totally right. Is it too late for Albacore now? When do they stop spawning? Oh, 6 p.m. to 2 a.m. So they didn't start spawning until 6 p.m. I, uh, I came way too early. That's why I hadn't got to Albacore yet. But anyway, we're going to fish till 2 a.m. And hope. 
and try to get an albacore. Albacore. Albacore tuna. We can do it. So yeah, I don't know. Like, mm -hmm. I was also thinking about watching F FB again. <laughs> why? <laughs> I mean, the first <laughs> one, sure. But like, why? Because I don't know. I'm way too poor do now. <laughs> don't torture yourself, you know? Like, I mean, there's a lot of value in the original Harry Potter movies. There's not much in the Fantastic Beast movies. So, you know, don't hurt yourself, Blue. Um, I give you something Lucas. to watch that's good. Um, oh. Abbott Elementary. Do you like sitcoms, Blue? Abbott Elementary is on is uh, in its second season right now, and it's like one of the best sitcoms I've ever seen. It's amazing and hilarious. Kendra, have you oh. watched Abbott Elementary? No, I haven't. It's so I, good. Lucas pushed something on my keyboard, and now there's a grid on my screen, and I'm very confused. Lucas, what? Oh, my God. I don't know. I liked Everybody Hates Chris. Well, you know what? It's got the main guy from Everybody Hates Chris. Um, I don't know if Abbott is for me. Abbott is for everybody, Blue. Abbott's for everybody. Unless you don't like sitcoms, then, like, don't bother. But it's good. I saw a few episodes. I see. Well, I watch it religiously. I love it. It's so good. The um the other day, no, just yesterday. Yesterday I was working and lady walked across the keyboard and pressed a bunch of keys and there was some pop-ups on my screen and I just closed them. I oh, didn't really goodness. think about it. But then uh -huh. I started trying to work and every time I pressed a key on my keyboard, I would hear this like weird dinging sound. And so I switched uh -oh. it back and forth from my headset to my computer speakers to see if it was like coming from the computer. And it was because it would switch back and forth. Um, mm -hmm. And the keyboard wasn't like fully responding properly. And it was so weird. And so I called help desk and they tried a couple things. They couldn't really figure it out. Like when I explained to them what was going on. Because of course I tried some stuff, you know, to try to get it to work and none of that worked. So I called them and they're like, try this other stuff and da 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 da. And then they were like, I don't know, freaking, I don't know, reboot. So, and, and we're going to look into it in case that doesn't work. So while I'm rebooting, the help desk dude is looking into it to see if he can find anything else. I come back from my reboot. I message him saying like, hey, I don't think it's happening anymore, but it was just really weird. Did you find anything? And he's like, yeah, I think dictation somehow got turned on. Here's the instructions on how to turn it off. And I was like, you know what? That makes sense. Because right before this started happening, um, lady walked across the keyboard and pressed a bunch of buttons oh and goodness. there was pop ups. And then he laughed. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> it was very confusing. And he was right. That is that is what had happened. The dictation feature in Windows had gotten turned on. Oh. <clears throat> oh, my God. I have level 10 fishing, and I can't. It's not freaking getting al albacore. Why? So many herrings. So many. No albacores. Albacore. There you are. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Sweet. Yay. Okay, wait, who wanted the albacore? Uh, Gus wanted the albacore. Gus is probably in bed by now. Well, he might yeah. be at the, he might be at the saloon still. Let's go look. What else have I been watching recently? Oh yeah, um we've been watching Schmigadoon has a new season. Okay, so that is basically this show that's like um it's like riffing on various musicals and uh its second season started and it's really good okay i'm not paying karen pay the fuck attention go to the actual saloon hello okay it closes at midnight so we'll have to do that tomorrow I'm gonna watch season three of dr stone soon i've not seen that yeah i don't know anything about that bad case of it fails yeah <laughs> it was and it was all the kitty cat's fault it was all the kitty cat's fault what else did i watch lately i watched the first episode of that beef show that everyone's talking about i liked it um it was pretty good you know um i haven't watched more of it yet so i can't say too much about an opinion on it okay are you done with your cracker okay i want Thanks. a cracker now mom I, too, would like a cracker. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds it's like a, great a good anime. time. Yeah, you've told me about it, and I've heard other people say it's good, too. Dr. Stone. Me. Like, I believe you. 
It probably <laughs> is good. Something I would like. Oop. Right. Okay. I need to get some tool upgrades. Yeah, go get them upgrades. That's, yeah. Okay, what am I doing? Oh, yeah, I gotta go find Gus. Uh, Gus, are you awake? Are you awake, Gus? Did you get two albacores? No. Ah, I'm sorry. That's okay. It's my fault. But here I gotta warp Totem Beach so that you can more efficiently get the albacores because they don't start spawning until 6 p.m. Um, 6 p.m. to 2 a.m. So there you go. I just Thank dug you. that up. <laughs> As you were walking by. <laughs> I think my fishing pole is in the mines. Oh, yep. there is a fishing pole in the mine, so yeah. There's a couple. <laughs> yeah, I'm not surprised. Gus, 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 I got your albacore. Hello. Oh, I can't go until 12? The heckin' heck. So he just uh... chills, chills in there until 12? Just whatever. Freaking Gus, okay. Fine. I didn't want to talk to you this early anyway, God. <laughs> I mean, it is 7 a.m. You know what? It's fine. I personally, I get mad when people call me at 8. So. I do too, but Gus is a video game person, so I don't care how he feels. <laughs> 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 All your HP discussions on Twitch were put on YouTube, right? That is absolutely right, Blue. You can find them on my YouTube channel inside the um the harry potter playlist you can find every single piece of my over 24 hours harry potter content um on my it's YouTube great conveniently you know like just objectively great thank you i appreciate you're welcome that. i think some of it's okay most of it is pretty bad but that's fine it's just a hobby so i'm not trying to be good yeah. i'm trying to have fun <laughs> 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 that funny Kendra yeah because I was sitting here going man should I really even try to stream Zelda games because yes. I'm not good at them yes at all. yes but girl, like have you watched a... me play Majora's Mask how much struggle yeah. bus I am on on like so yeah, many of those like, side quests different. how I don't know you're you yeah <laughs> Please. Like, it's just different when it's Karen. It's, it's different when it's... Karen's allowed to fail, but Kendra's not. Is that what yes. this is? Okay. That's exactly what this is. You know what? <laughs> Hard disagree. Kendra, you can fail. It's okay. I mean, oh, I'm going at to. some point, we're going to run out of games that I actually really know a lot about, and I'm going to fail, like, so much extra harder. Um, you know, which Gosh. is part of... Which is, I'm not going to lie, part of why we're doing this, like, week-long play Final Fantasy X-2 experiment, um, because that's not a game I know like super duper freaking crazy well. And so it's gonna be mm -hmm. like backseating and courage and all that. And I wanna see like how I do on a stream with a game that I don't know every fucking little thing about. That's fair. Um, Cause you know, I the reason why some games I know a lot about is cause I've played them 50 times. And like, there's only so many games that you can play so many times, you know, for the time that you have on this earth. So, yeah, I need to figure out how to stream games that I don't know that well. You knew 10 better than yeah. 2. That's right. I know 10. I, I knew, I know everything about freaking Final Fantasy 10. Um, 10 2, I keep like trying to play and beat. So, like, I know a lot about chapter 1. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, but yeah, I've never made it to chapter 5. I've only made it to chapter 4 once. Usually I get to like somewhere in chapter 3 and then I get bored and stop playing. So I keep trying to beat this game and I never have. Um, so hence the, you know, we're going to try to get 100% in a week, see if we can do it. I've got like a guide that I put together that's an amalgamation of a few different um, game facts guides of 10 to, so that to try to m make it possible. But we'll see. I don't even, I don't even know if this is like physically, literally possible. If I have given, if it takes longer than the amount of hours that exist in one week to beat this game, you know, I'm, I might have given myself an impossible task, but we'll see. Backseating will be I, heavily encouraged. I don't know. I think because it's Final Fantasy, you gave yourself an impossible task. <laughs> but 10-2 is supposedly shorter. I don't know. Maybe I did. 
I I'm think not trying to like impossible to ask. I'm not trying to like get a true 100%. I just because the game has like a percentage completion that it tells you you're doing in there. So I'm just trying to reach what the game considers 100%. That's not real 100% of that game, of course. There's stuff that you can do that doesn't count towards your percentage points. So okay. that's the goal. We'll see if it happens. I believe in you. Thank you. I believe in me too. But I don't know. I might have like I might have given myself impossible tasks. We'll find out. <laughs> find out together. There you go. Yeah, you can have this side in your mouth. But I never get 100%. You have to follow a guide. Yes, I do know that. I do know that to potentially get 100%, like you have to follow a guide, or you just have to do New Game Plus and play the game like two or three times. Um, that uh, within one single playthrough, you can't get 100% without a guide. Like it's really not humanly possible to remember every little thing you're supposed to do to make that happen. So I do have a guide that um, I put together for myself, amalgamation of multiple different game facts guides. So like, I think if it's possible, I have prepared the things that need to be prepared to make it possible. Other than, of course, me going through and actually beating the game once for myself so that I know what happens in it. I haven't done that. <laughs> <laughs> well fine you've convinced me mm -hmm. my shining personality will just have to be enough yeah well i think that's all that really that's all that really matters with streaming i don't know like i watch plenty of streamers that are really fucking bad at video games and i still find them very entertaining yeah i mean i also watch streamers that are good at video games like i think it just it just depends i watch both there's those madmen that speed run 100%. Oh my god, I would die. That sounds like really frustrating and annoying trying to speed run 100% in a Final Fantasy game. Sounds like a bad time. Yeah. Oh yay, my mining leveled up. Oh yay. Yay. Mm -hmm. so, didn't get the combat level up, but at least I got a mining level up. That's helpful. That's still something. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, got a treasure chest. Yay, bait. Love bait. Me too. Oh. Now what are you going to do? Oh, I would love to level up in fishing. You can do it. Sitting, sitting on do the you, dock. Just do, you, do you have the mod constantly. that turns off the minigame? Of course I do. Good. Then you Listen, can definitely I... do it have the mod that turns off the fishing minigame in Stardew. I refuse to do the uh, motion control shrines in Breath of the Wild. Uh huh. I am all about making games fun for me. Yeah. I also won't do the motion control ones. Like, I either don't do them or I turn off the motion controls so that you have to do it the other way. Yeah. Um, because, like, no fucking way. Fuck that. Yeah. Like, no thank you. It's just not fun. I don't enjoy them. To play more Fire Emblem. I've never played a Fire Emblem game. Um, but they do look like something up my alley. But I never have actually I played one. Hear people love them. Me too. They have a big, big following. Yeah, I know. It sounds super fun. I know Levi's played a few of them, super so I've fun. watched um, playthroughs of some of them from like when he's played them. But I never have played one myself. It takes a lot of hurdles to go through on my end. What does that mean, Blue? What hurdles? Finding proper uh, translations and patches. Oh, yeah, yeah, because a lot of them have not been fair. released here, right? I know, that's very upsetting when it's Japan-only game. I agree, Lucas. I that's... That. It makes it hard. Yeah. Die, ghosty. Get him. Get it, get it. Okay. Yeah. Well, oh, buddy, when you drop things, they go to the floor. I gotta go. I don't dish. know how else to tell you. Really, Mom? That's so lame. Yeah. What do you mean gravity works? It should stop. Right? It'd make my life easier. <laughs> <laughs> oh, squid. Let's see. My That's energy not what I want, is pretty low, but I still have some health. I'm getting closer to the level up for the combat. I believe in you. You can do it. Um, oh my goodness. Yeah, I'm so I'm done with seaweed. 
Even when you get fishing level 10, you still end up with lots of seaweed. I know. It's just part of it. Yeah. Just wish it didn't use energy to get the yeah, seaweed. Yeah, me too. Ugh. Oh my goodness. So I tried those polygel nails. Oh, really? How did it turn out? Uh, there's a learning curve. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there we go. Got my albacore. Albacore is what we needed, right? Yeah, you do need albacore. Awesome. And you give it oh, to hello, Gus. hello, buddy. Which yeah. you still have time, actually, to make it to the saloon, I'm pretty sure, because it closes at midnight, I think is what I found out. I've got time. It's only eight. Yeah, you can make it. Yay, uh, I got level five. Um, yay. Oh, there's a cutscene in here. Okay. Whoops. Um. Uh, it was super cool. I think that if I practice a little more, I'll really like it. Mm -hmm. um, I just... The way that I found that everyone was saying, like, yeah, take them off by soaking your fingers in hot water with a little bit of dish soap. And they just mm. come right oh. off. That was not the case for me. Yeah, I don't and, I don't know anything uh, about that. Um, I'm just like, oh, man, maybe, my poor nails. Maybe poly gel is different than other gels. But, like, um, I have always had to soak gel nails in acetone mm -hmm. it's supposed to be a way that you can just like pop them off without doing the acetone but i, I don't think that's the way for me yeah i don't i don't know anything or about my that. water sounds, wasn't hot enough it sounds fake honestly i don't i don't know but maybe i just don't know how to do it but i just i don't understand that yeah it, it doesn't make sense to me yeah oh, i don't know man. I would see I if somebody like through. Nail Career Education or Simply No Logical, like somebody that has like a yeah. lot of um, nail content, what they have to say about how to get them off. And I would do whatever they said. It, that's, yeah, it's going to be soaking, I'm sure. But I didn't but have water. the soaky thing. And I was like, this is, this is nice. Oh, you know what I do? Hang on. Let me, let me show you this. Um, you have to look at the camera for a second. I'm looking. So I have these thingies, these little rubbery things like this. Yes, I was going to go get those. Yeah. Are they good? Yes. Oh, yes. awesome. Um, I That's what I have always used to get gel nails off when I used to do those more frequently. Um, and that way, like, I still had, like, full use of my fingers. It was way easier than trying to do the... Um, foil method to to put that on and off like yeah um, yeah so that's what i would recommend oh good okay fabulous i've got to go to the store today so i was gonna pick those up while i'm there yeah if you can find them at like a beauty supply store i would do that um oh, they've i think got them at i want to say i want to say i ordered mine off of like Shoot, what was that website that we used to order stuff off of? Not Sheen, but it's what everyone was ordering Wish. before Sheen. Yeah, I think I ordered mine off of Wish. Oh my goodness. I have to say, I've ordered Eliza like princess costumes off of Wish, and they're really nice quality. Yeah, I mean, I, I've ordered stuff off of Wish when it was popular, and um, I never got poor quality stuff. Now, sometimes I got... It took forever to get here. Yes. <laughs> but it never was poor quality. It was always like exactly what was advertised. It just might take two months to get to me. Which I, I'm i so impatient. Like I don't like online shopping anywhere for that reason. We do lots of Amazon online shopping, but we have Prime. So I we have Prime too, and it's starting to take like a long time, even with Prime. Really? Yeah. That's interesting. Not for us. Fighter. I don't know if I want Fighter versus Scout. Does anybody watching in the chat have an opinion? Remember one time Mom bought me something from Wish, and instead they sent a Curly Pokemon card. Still winning. <laughs> oh, well, you know, still winning. I. That's a cool card, I'm sure. <laughs> Kelly is the one that looks like a ballerina. Yeah. It's just, like, why a single Pokemon card would be my question. 
Okay, fighter is what, my, what I choose. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I Killian, know, Killian is the emotion Pokemon. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we love her. Mm -hmm. It's a good She's Pokemon. She's pretty. And we got the cards on Valentine's Day. Wow. Blue, they just knew that's what you actually needed. Yes. Oh, Queen of um, Sauce for a new recipe today. Oh, yay. Cranberry candy. Uh, okay. Yum. I love that blue. That's amazing. Okay. Uh, Is there... I... Sorry, go ahead. I just... discovered a very old Pokemon Go tool for finding groups to remote raid. Really? Right, yes, right when they raised the price of remote raid passes. I, I heard Levi and Jeff complaining about that the other day. And, it's absolutely um, ridiculous. So explain it to me. Like, what did they change? Because I know it's annoying and everyone hates it, but I don't play that game anymore, so I don't fully understand. Um, basically, you can only do five remote raids a day. Mm-hmm. Which, weird, but whatever. You can only hold three remote raid passes in your inventory. Okay. And they used to be, like, 100 coins or so 125. So basically, you can have three, and then you have to go buy two more to do your five a day. If you want to max yes. out. I, you have to buy these... Anyway, there's no way to get, at least as far as I know, there's no way to get the remote raid passes without spending pokey coins. Okay. A Here. new baby lizard hatched. Oh, yay! We got the dinosaur then. Finally. So it'll lay dinosaur eggs, then we can t use that dinosaur egg for the museum. Yes. Sweet. Oh, good. We got a duck feather. I so, okay, pressed so wait. the wrong thing. That's kind and of... it's like 195 pokey coins to get the raid pass now. How much is that in dollar dollar bills? Um, I don't, know, I don't know. I don't really do the microtransactions. You can only earn 50 pokey coins a day from getting kicked out of gyms. Oh my god. Yeah, so it, it's a little bit rough if you don't want to spend real life money. So truly the five a day is meaningless because it's absolutely meaningless who's gonna spend the, enough money to even get to their five a day max right yeah okay i'm understanding why this is in fucking sane now um yeah it's um not my favorite thing yeah I right mean, okay as i discovered a but way is, to do remote rates but this is ridiculous because like okay most of America, where a lot of people are playing this game, in America, and of mm -hmm. course I'm in America, so that's what I'm going to talk about is America. Yep. Um, fuck yeah. Coming again to save the motherfucking day. Yeah. Um, so like, but what about people playing in rural areas? Do they just not give a fuck? What about people who don't have a group of people to continually go raid? Exactly. What about people who aren't able to um... You know, there's chronically ill people that can't reliably go out. There's yeah. lots of reasons why people aren't able to go raid in person. It's like, and literally, it, do they think you're worthless if you can't go walk around? It's, like, is that what it they, is? Their um, reasoning was they want to promote, you know, walking around and exploring Pokemon Go in the real world. I mean, I can agree with that, but the reality like, of our then world you is need that to, that's not reasonable. Yeah, you need to incentivize going out then, not mm -hmm. penalize. Yeah, so like not being it's... able to. Exactly. So like make it so that when you go to the raid, like physically you get some kind of bonus that you can't get for the remote raids, but don't limit the remote raids. Let people mm. still remote raid as much as they fucking want. I you know? I mean either way, like the only way to get the remote raid passes was to spend the in-game currency. So Why what were they thinking? I don't know. That doesn't make any sense. It makes very little sense. I know. It's ridiculous. But, and it's just, you know, the only way that a lot of people, because 
very few people play Pokemon Go anymore, it seems like, right. which is fine. It's I an, get it. It's become a niche game. It's not popular anymore. Yeah. So you're not finding, you know, people just like hanging out at gyms to raid. Yeah. Yeah, like that's not so. really a thing people do. No, it's, the gotcha it's aspect not. of Go never appealed. Well, you know what? When Go first came out, it was not that gotcha. It really wasn't. It wasn't. Yeah, um, it was great the when first it first few came years, out. I, I played pretty religiously, and it was f like legitimately fun and a legitimate way to like meet people and make friends. Like it was yes. not. It was not like it is now. Everyone was out, and you could would just go and talk to people and form a community, and it was really cool. Mm -hmm. But like, it's fun for me now because I go on a, a walk to pick up my daughter from the bus stops. It's like, yeah, mm -hmm. of course I'm going to open up Pokemon Go while I'm doing this. Right. Why wouldn't I? Hey, Jacob, but, how's it going? Yeah. I hope you're having an amazing weekend. I still play a lot, Hi, but I slowed Jacob. down since they raised raid passes. Yeah, that's what started this, yep. um, started this conversation mm -hmm. is talking about how they raised that. It just seems... Um, it just seems so silly to me. Like they, it's, it's just shooting themselves in the foot. Exactly. Like I, I can see like why they have the desires that they have, but I don't see how this is beneficial to growing their community or keeping the people currently in their community happy. And so when I kind of try to microphone. square the game against like any sort of community goals or like profit goals or you know those types of goals that game companies would typically have i just don't see it you know i just don't see it it does it, not match because it's not squared yeah it doesn't match any kind of goals you, that you can't game square that circle naturally have so i don't understand it yes guys uh, i brought you your albacore i need to find elliot okay so i upgraded my last gold tool so i'm on the iridium level now for the tools but i'm going to stop upgrading them for a minute um and i would recommend oh you man doing i'm the same to try to get just getting gold. steel you're just getting steel that's okay that's okay we do yeah. we need the tool upgrades so and uh whenever kitty plays next time i'll encourage her to do the same try to get up to gold tools gosh kitty yeah okay come here elliot i've got a duck feather for you Yay. He loves I it. was just clicking through the cutscene that I had in the bar and I picked the option that makes him sad. Oh no. Oops. Yeah. And I feel so bad. It was that you made it. Just Elliot go, sad just go. in an Elliot cutscene. Oh no. Or, or like just frustrated. It was the wrong option. Poor man. That sucks. I you know. Poor me. Oh, well, he's not home. But I can still walk in his house, so Let's turn you know some at least there's that. Into jelly. Yeah. Since we only have two kegs and we have lots of um jelly casket there things, I'm taking some of the fruit out of the wine stuff and having the, having it turn into jelly instead. Perfect. Yeah, I know bait causes fish to bite faster. I don't fish, Willie. You know this. Ah, how did you do that? Okay, buddy. Where's the, rest of the skeleton? Aha, you're there. Okay. We got another part of the skeleton thing from the museum. Oh, good. So we just need his tail now. Yeah. Get it. We can get the tail. We can. Get the tail. Get the tail. Okay. What other quests do I have? Ten pieces of hardwood for Robin. Okay. Where's Robin at? Hey, Karen, if you're interested in Fire Emblem, I'd recommend Three Houses because it has fishing in it. Wow, Blue, why do you hate me? <laughs> do you just, do you just, did you just like wake up this morning and say like, what can I say to hurt Karen the most? Yes. Um, and then you've been just waiting for the opportunity. Is that what just happened? 
You got a switch. Yes. I do have a switch. Yes. I have other several pastime gameplay loops. I only, I only, really only hate fishing in Stardew. Is the truth. So that was kind of a joke. Um, I like the fishing in. Um, let's see. I like the fishing in. Uh, uh, Animal Crossing, for example. I've been up several hours already. <laughs> Fucking Christ, blue. Just waiting. <laughs> Just waiting. <laughs> Planning. Oh my god. Planning the attack. <laughs> Where nobody? Maru, let me in to see your mom. The door's locked, but she's inside. Whatever. Maru, Maru, open up. Let me at that mill. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I saw a YouTube video the other day about like somebody reading bad reviews of stardew valley and the amount of people that left <gasps> yes. a bad review because they wanted to marry robin was ridiculous i don't blame them <laughs> i'm selling the stone that i fished up okay what other quests do i have right now 25 for skull caverns i gotta level up my Okay, we're gonna have cool. to get some We've amaranth some... Oh. when that comes back around because i have that i'm gonna get a Me melon too. some pale ale and i need to make friends i need to make friends with um with the girl to get lewis's shorts Ugh. um no you just need to put a chair in front of her door <laughs> oh my god no it's not that hard to make friends with her <laughs> Once it rolls back around to spring, I'll just give her flowers until I'm good enough friends. What is my heart level with her right now? It might even already be not too bad. Let's see. Where's she at? Where's that girl? Marnie. There we go. I've got... Oh, I've not even got two hearts with her. So I have to get some more hearts. <clears throat> and she'll take the sweet peas. I know that. Yeah, she will. She likes those. And it's about to be spring. We're going to wake up to spring tomorrow, I think, right? It's day 28. <gasps> Yay! We're going to be officially Springtime. starting year two, guys. Woohoo! What? And actually, I think... New Year's party. Yeah. Actually, and actually, I think this might be the good spot to end, Kendra. So next stream, we can That's start perfect. on year yeah. two. Yeah. So we'll, we'll do our good news article once you come to bed. That's great. Yeah, I know. Good news time. Good mm -hmm. news time. I love how it's once we come to bed and I just come crawl right into your bed. <laughs> you always do that too. You lay that way so that we sleep nose to nose. <laughs> yep. <laughs> We're snuggling. <laughs> what else are you supposed to do? <laughs> Nothing else. Made a lot of money today that. though. This is this is Stardew. So of course we sleep yes. snuggly. So yeah, day one of spring year two. So this is where we'll start when we load up the Perfect. game next time. So let's go ahead and end it. Switch back to the webcam. And my steel hoe is ready. Yay. That's awesome. Okay, so we're going to exit the game. Perfect. Goodbye. All right. Goodbye. Goodbye, game. All right. Are you ready for some good news, Kendra? Yes. I saw that video you posted, but it's a TikTok, and I don't want to play TikToks on stream because... That's fine. Yeah. I know that should... they have, like... A, it, in a news article somewhere i just yeah i'm sure it they on do tiktok and was like this is cool yeah but if y'all want to see the video i'm talking about you need to get in my discord server okay so that you can see that it's in the stream chat in there all right so for everybody watching um on youtube we're gonna go ahead and say goodbye and and in the vod good news is for twitch you got to be live to get the good news so for everybody on youtube thank you uh -huh. so much for watching don't Sorry. forget to like comment subscribe down below and of course as always don't forget to make it a great day